human brains have a whole spoonful of nanoplastics yeah. Uh, the size of a plastic spoon, a whole spoon. Oh, the whole the spoon entire pool. spoon. Cognitively normal human brain samples collected at autopsy in early 2024 contain more tiny shards of plastic than samples collected eight years prior, according to a new study. <laughs> so it's an increase in the amount of nanoplastics that they're finding in cadavers. We're carrying around plastic spoons in our heads. Yeah, no wonder we have brain fog. <laughs> Overall, I... cadaver... How? How does plastic get into our brain? <laughs> Holy moly. Overall, cadaver brain samples contain seven to 30 times more tiny shards of plastic than their mm. kidneys and liver, said co-lead study author Matthew Campen, uh, Regents Professor hurt. and Professor of Pharmaceutical Sciences at the University of New Mexico in Albuquerque. The concentrations we saw in the brain tissue of normal individuals who had an average age of around 45 or 50 years old were 4,800 micrograms per gram or 0.48% by weight. That's the equivalent of an entire standard plastic spoon. 